Hello everybody, my name is Emmett, and today I'm going to be talking about athletic cups. So most of you are probably familiar with these. If you are not, um, athletic cups are, I mean, basically what they sound like. Uh, you people with penises put these in their pants and it helps protect their junk if they're playing like contact sports. Um, because this is hard plastic. And... The sides here on my specific one, not all of these are like this, but most of the ones I feel like you find are like this, uh, is like a flexible plastic because that's the part that's going to be like pressed up against your legs, so it makes it a little more comfortable. Uh, this one in particular, I think, is either a small or a youth size. I think it's maybe a youth large, uh, which would be like a men's small, basically. Um, and these are actually really easy to use. So normally you would wear these with a jock strap or compression shorts, um, and then you would have your uh, pants over that. Um, so all you do, see there is a wide side and then there is a narrow side. So the wide side is gonna be going up sort of like towards your belly button. Uh, the narrow side is gonna sort of go between your legs. That's why it's narrow, makes it more comfortable. And it'll sit basically like this up against you. So you can use these uh, with or without a packer. It doesn't matter. Um, and I can't find any of my jock straps. So for the sake of this video, I'm going to be using these jock male underwear uh, because most jock straps that you'll find um, have a pocket. I don't know if you can see that because these are black, dark blue, but there's a pocket here. And normally this pocket is supposed to be for packers, but for this video, we're going to use it for our athletic cup. So literally, all you do, find your pocket, take the narrow side, stick it in there. So it'll look like this in your jock strap. Your jock strap will actually probably go down further. These underwear are really short, um, so they it looks like it comes up really far. Uh, but your jock strap or your compression shorts sometimes have a pocket too. Uh, but that pocket should be bigger so things will fit a little bit better. And that's all you do. Got it in there, you're protected. Uh, if you want to use this with a packer, uh, fair warning, I'm going to be showing a packer here. Uh, so I have this one. This is just a small packer. Uh, I would recommend using smaller packers for these, though, um, just because it can get kind of uncomfortable with a bigger packer. Uh, but all I do is take your packer, put it in here, and you can just kind of tuck it in there so it's basically sitting like this. Wide side up, narrow side down. And honestly, you're just going to do the same exact thing. So you've got your pocket here. And make sure your packer doesn't fall out the back. There you go. So now you've got your packer in there. You've got your cup in there. Still protected. And your packer sits right in the hollow space in that cup. Because that's what it's made for. But... Uh, just a sort of side note, if you are, you know, you really, really, really want something uh, to give you a bulge in your pants, but you don't have a way to order anything online, uh, or you don't have a lot of money to spend, you can find these in most places, honestly. So any kind of sporting goods store, uh, so like Dick's Sporting Goods, if you have like a, a Dunham's or something, you can find these super easily. Um, and this one I bought at Walmart. So you can also find them at Walmart. Um, and I believe this was only like $12. Um, so it's basically the same concept as the foam packing inserts that you'll see that are just like a uh, shape like this, but it's like a soft foam. Exact same thing. This one's just plastic. Um, so yeah, if you have any questions about this uh, or if you have anything that you want me to make a video on, uh, please let me know. I love to read all of your comments. Um, they're what I use to know what videos to make next. So, yeah.